All right, YouTube, what's up, man? We back with another video today. And today, we in the, uh, up here at the storage building, and we uh, messing with the truck, of course. Um, we had to do a few things, nothing crazy, but we did have to get a couple things done. Got the little guy with me back there, y'all can see him. Tyrese, say what's up. What's up, YouTube? All right, yeah. So, all he do is come up here and play with stuff. I'm going to show y'all what he be playing with in a second, because that's all he do. Every time he come up here, he want to play with stuff. He don't really help. So, um, I actually been doing this for a couple of days, but I uh, just hadn't recorded because it takes so much time. And then from what I was doing, I didn't want to mess nothing up. So, just to show you guys real quick uh, what I've been doing, uh, let me show you real fast. So, let me, uh, hold on. So, Rick, before we do this, man, I need y'all to like, share, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell for me. Uh, subscriptions don't cost nothing. All you got to do is click the subscribe button, and then you uh, you in there. Just catch me. So watch what I do. And like I said, I work on the truck. I uh, do a little motorcycle stuff, and you know, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. So, basically, what's going to be going on is I'm going to be uh, working on the truck, and then, like I said, I work on my bike, do some upgrades to the bike. I got some stuff for that, and I'll show y'all uh, in a uh, few videos. But I got some stuff for the uh, bike, and I still been getting parts in for the truck. So, with that being said, let me uh, show y'all what I've been working on up here so I can get some stuff done. All right? Let me tell y'all real quick. So, what I did is I recorded a video a few days ago but i recorded it on my camera and what happened was it didn't have volume so i just let it be that <clears throat> so i'm recording on my phone but i like it a little bit better because i use my uh dji gimbal and uh i like it it it's a little bit more nimbler it's nimble and i can uh the, the picture looks better to me when i record on my phone versus when i record with the um camera so let me show you guys what i've been working on okay all right guys so basically what we got here get this thing on all right so everybody know what that looked like right there that's been jacked up i just gotta get it fixed my brother I'm waiting on my brother right there he's gonna wear that for me he can wear it. so what i've done is i undercoated the bottom see the difference right there and then I also, let me show you this side right here. I also did the uh, frame all the way back to the uh, to the bed. So, and then I uh, I lifted the. Uh, let me show you here. Excuse me, buddy. I I lifted the truck, the cab. I lifted the cab. You can see there. And so I undercoated it, put a coating under the, underneath it just to keep it nice and neat clean and then I sprayed the, uh, the frame so now I did that so I can get the uh, what you call it done so I can get the uh, mounts under here I wanted to do all of that before I got the mounts under here so basically that's what I've done the last few days is uh coated the bottom and I do and I use uh, let me show you what I use, I use a couple different things. Whoa, another file. So, to do the bottom of the truck, I use this just truck bed under uh, truck bed coating, and I use that for underneath the truck. And it's just some stuff like it's rubberized and stuff like that. So, that's what I use for the bottom of the truck. And this is what I use. I've used this on most of the frame. Chassis roll bar. And I use the gloss. I don't use the flat. But uh, roll bar chassis plank. That's what I use for the frame. So that's what we got going on there. And I got a lot of empty cans. And then I also spray some primer underneath the truck on the body. Under the, under the cab. And then I also spray the, the frame also with some primer. Uh, this is what I use. I got this from AutoZone. 
and I used that before I uh, sprayed it. So um, let me see if y'all can see right here. <clears throat> so right, let it focus, focus, baby. Focus down. Wee. So yeah, there we go. All right, so yeah, that's uh, and I didn't coat this yet. I ran out of uh, undercoating. I got everything underneath. I just need to spray from from there to here to get it done. And so that's that'll be the next thing I do. And this thing I focus. Hold on. All right, y'all. So I got the focus. So like I was saying. Um, I hadn't sprayed any of this on this side. I did the other side down there. I haven't sprayed on this side, but underneath I have already sprayed and uh, I got to put the mounts on, but I'm going to spray the coating on there first before I put the mounts on it. I'm going to try to get under the truck and let y'all see the under the truck right quick. All right, so this the under part of the truck where I just sprayed the frame right there that's the frame and then if you can see up there i spray the undercoating it's kind of shiny it's still a little wet but that's the undercoating i spray up there because otherwise it would look like like that all rusty see that, see that back yeah that's the bed I haven't done that part yet. I'm gonna take the bed off, but when I take the bed off, I'll uh, coat the coat that part of it. So basically, like I said, I just did the uh, the under part of the truck. That's the frame. Like I said, and that's what I got. Let me see if I can show y'all the. Uh, That's just wet. Some of it's dry, some of it's wet. But that's the undercoating. That's the frame right there. Uh, yeah, and that's what we've been doing. Now I got my truck jacked up. I got a block <laughs> and a jack stand. Same thing here a block and a dang on jack stand. That's what we got there. Same thing on this side too. So uh, we're gonna get try to get moving on this thing, man. I'm trying to. I need to get some work done. I've been buying a few things, but not a lot because the money don't let me. Money don't let me. So see that? Nice and shiny. That's all I wanted, man. I just didn't want it rusty. Like, I ain't trying to make a show truck. I just wanted a nice and clean in the beer. So that's what we got. All right, guys. So next video. What we're gonna do, some uh, body bushings, and we're gonna install those. And basically, they go like this, like this one, just for reference, it goes in the bottom, like this, where the radiator support goes. So it basically goes like that. And that one sits on top, so they go like that. The bushing gonna snap around, and then I gotta put a plate on top of here, and then plate right there go on top. This goes on the bottom of here like that, like that, and then uh, goes up through here, and then bolt goes through radiator support type now and it's basically the same principle with the same thing for the body mounts and so I got the two for the front two for the back and so that's what we're gonna do in the next video we're gonna go ahead bolt that down tighten that up and then like I said I need to tighten all this stuff up because I ain't tightened all that up yet I just need to go ahead and tighten this stuff up all that stuff still loose but I will be tightening that up also, I'll be tightening up the suspension on it. I gotta tighten up the lower control arm down there. The upper control arm, gotta tighten it up. Um, that's it, just little stuff, man. I just, 
hadn't been doing, but yeah, lower control arm, gotta tighten it, upper control arm, tighten it, and uh, I got the ball joints tight, I mean, the uh, tie rods tight, but I gotta tighten up the rest of this stuff, and we're gonna move from there, and after I do that, I'm gonna take the bed off the truck, uh, and then try to probably put the motor and the trans in here, then take the bed out. Frame, do that part of the frame, coat the uh, coat the underbody of the bed, and then uh, what else? Uh, something else I gotta do. Um, oh yeah, and then put the, fuel, the gas tank, which is right here. It's a gas tank right here, and put the fuel pump. It's somewhere in here. Oh, I got one. I just don't know where it's at, but it's somewhere. Um, I don't know where it's at, but it's in here somewhere. I got a fuel pump for it. it might be it right there. No, it's an empty box. But fuel pump in here somewhere. Just gotta find it. It's somewhere. Yeah, there it is down there. And I can see it right there behind these wheels fuel pump down there that gray box with that g and n on it that's the fuel pump so i had to get that and uh get that wired get that on and shit try to go from there i got a wiring harness it's back there in my bins um the dang on fuel kit is in here got that the fuel line so i could uh wire that stuff up to put the fuel lines on here fuel lines the uh fittings too so i'll show y'all that later but yeah fuel lines fittings all up in there got all that stuff so um that's that's about it so y'all so i guess that's gonna be this that that for this one gonna call it a night on this one and um i just wanted to kind of show y'all what i've been working on that i've been working on it so that's what we got going and yeah we're gonna uh trying to get some progress done on this thing so i'll get it y'all in the next video may y'all like share subscribe hit that notification bell and comment on the video for me and uh i'm out to the next one peace